All right, hello and welcome to my channel. Age is just a number and my name is Barbara Jean. This is a channel for women over 40, over 50, over 60, over 70 and beyond who have a love of fashion and beauty. And today it's about fashion and maybe a little bit of beauty. <laughs> so it is going to be um, a haul. Um, these were some that I've just accumulated over the past month probably that I have not shown you. Uh, so and they're all from Marshalls. I think there is one item from TJ Maxx. So and you know those are the same company. So uh, we're going to do that and um, I'm going to show you these. I'm not going to do a lookbook right now. That'll become that'll come later. Uh, so this is going to try and keep it as short today. And then at the end, I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to talk about a um, a challenge that I'm putting out there. So if you want to see what I got, stay tuned, and we'll get started on it. We're going to get started on this little haul right now. But first of all, I want to say if you are a first time here on my channel and you like what you see, please consider subscribing. It means the world to me. Hit that little bell. You'll be notified every time I make a new video. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for coming back to visit with me time and time again, because I know you are busy. So with that said, let's get started on this haul. So first of all is, because I've already got this on the hanger, and I've got to reach, sorry, <laughs> because I wore it yesterday. I had a doctor's appointment yesterday and I wore this. Um, this is a top by W5. There's the brand on it and it was at TJ Maxx for $14.99. Now the reason I chose this is because it is the peasant style. I don't know if you can see this with the black. It does have the he keyhole. If I could put my hand in here. Keyhole right there. Oh, looks like I did my fingers. It looks like cleavage. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and the little sleeve with the little um, ruffle on the end, which it's just nice and loose and it has holes in it. It's perforated. So I don't know if you can see that. There you can kind of in the light. There you can see it back here in the light. So it's very cool, very breathable. And I thought this would go great. Oh, there goes the focus if I move too quick. Um, I thought it would go great with denim, shorts, jeans, white, whatever. It's just a good basic top to have for summertime. So there is that one. All right. What? These are some shoes that I found. And you know, one of the hot trends right now is the braided detail. So I found these little flats and these are by Mila Paoli and they're made in Italy and it is a true suede and let's see, yeah, leather uppers. Mm -hmm. and what does this have? Let's see, made in Italy, genuine leather. Yeah. So these are the little sandals I got, and they were $19.99. So I wear a lot of peaches and corals and orange and reds and stuff, and I thought these would be a great, even just with, with white, they would just be a wonderful pop of color. So that's all right. Here is a skirt 
and this is from Marshalls and it was $14.99. Now, I love wearing skirts and dresses in the summer because it just gets so stinking hot. But it is by Max Studio. And it, yeah. I'll get it done there. There it is, Max Studio. And it is kind of, um, it's got a le little bitty elastic waist here. Uh, it is a, the yoke of it, which is this part right here, is kind of a dropped yoke, I guess what you could call. And it is the, um, the fabric is, I don't want to say, uh, I forget what it's called, but it's, it's, very very fine pleated gathered right up there and goes to about right to here and then the rest of it is just a sheer fabric you can see I'm trying to I've got the light behind me so you can kind of see but there is it is also lined so it's this beautiful marigold or mustard yellow color with brown and ivory flowers except the bottom of it is this part of the fabric is uh, black and white. So kind of different colors there about that, but I thought even just with a little white t-shirt, that might be just cute uh, to, you know, dress up a little hot day outfit. So the next item is, oh, I have been looking for a white dress for summer. And I found this one at Marshall's. And this is by Japana, J-A-P-N-A. And it is just a white eyelet. White eyelet dress with the ruffle trend bottom because you know one of the the trends for this summer is tiered dresses so this is definitely what's called a tiered dress it has uh, just the eyelet um, top and it is lined on the top I'm trying to think and the lining it's under here and it goes down to where the first ruffle is so nothing showing through it's got the adjustable straps and because this is one of those outfits that for a really hot day that I don't want to put bra on <laughs> so if you want to know how I get around that uh, let me know down below and I'll do a video for you on that so another item that oh did I tell you the price on that one I'm sorry the price on this one was $19.99 so Edgecovich uh-huh okay this one I was so excited because this is my color I absolutely love green 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 so this is a dress by Cynthia Rowley and let me zip it back up here in this beautiful green and it is linen all linen the bodice part is lined but the rest of it is not and the straps in the back are adjustable now what I have to look at when I'm buying dresses is where the waist is because I am so short-waisted and it really helps to know your body type <laughs> and to where when you look at an out you look at a piece of clothing and you know if the cut of it is going to work for you or not and because of this was a higher waist I knew that I could get away with it if sometimes the waist are down to here and then it sits on my hips and that's not attractive for me at all. So it either has to be non-waist or the waist has to be much higher. So, and my body type is a, um, is a curvy, um, which is, doesn't mean that it's plus size. It means curvy is not the same as plus size. So curvy is described in the dictionary as an hourglass figure, which is what my my body type is according to my measurements so but it does have pockets and it's linen so here's another one that i can get away with in the hot summer days without a bra all right what else oh 
I'm going to show you this. Look at this. I did my nails yesterday. I decided to, you know, I'm always doing the Dashing Diva nails. And I decided to uh, just put on some regular color polish. I saw somebody wearing this color and I thought, I want to do this. I did them yesterday. Base coat. Two uh, coats of polish and then a top coat. Yesterday. And look, they're already chipping. <sighs> so... I don't even want to go into that. Okay, so I found at Marshall's uh, Dashing Diva, which you know I'm an affiliate of them, so they I have a do I do have a link down below. But these were I think typically they're eight dollars. Now these are beautiful blue, kind of a periwinkle blue and silver, and then this one is a very dark, almost almost like a purple black almost but I love the accents in them and these were both $4.99 now you can tell um, the the new ones for 2021 in Dashing Diva come in a box um, so for 2020 they were in a thin packet and you can also see right here on there whenever you come across them that they're 2020 now does that mean that they're expired no because i have used plenty of them that were from 2020 and they're still good so i got those two and then i found uh the eyebrow pencils that i like and these are the Maybelline and it's the Brow Ultra Slim and this one is or both of these are in color 256 warm brown auburn now I like I've already opened this because I was using it I like to use I have one in blonde that I use as a basic because of the blonde hair and then because I have the auburn highlights put into it I mix a little bit of that in my brow as well so these were you can see them $2.99 at Marshall. So whenever I see these, I pick up, pick them up and pick up extras because that's half price as well, too. So, and I'm thinking that's it. That's all I got. This was just a quick little haul. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you about a um, I put out an invitation on my community tab and on my Instagram post for uh, that I'm inviting people to uh, creators to come and uh, join me in a challenge for the 4th of July using only products made in the USA. So that is up on my community post and in my Instagram. If you're a creator and you're interested in it, reach out to me and I'll get you the information on it. So that's all I got. I do have a little June bug down here below. Hey June, do you want to say hello? Oh, she says yes. Come here, baby. Oh, there she is. Do you want to say hello to everybody? Say hello. Show me your pretty little face. Show me your pretty little face. She says, I'm camera shy. <laughs> I just want to be held. <laughs> so I'm going to get out of here now, everybody. So thank you so much for coming and visiting with me today. I appreciate it so much. So remember, ladies, what do we tell them? We tell them every day, get up and show up because you are worth it. So until I see you in my next video, have a very safe and a very blessed day. <laughs> Say bye. Say bye. <laughs> she didn't like that at all. <laughs> See ya.